Hello. Oh my god, I'm so worn out. I've been shooting for over six hours today, and I gotta get up at like six o'clock in the morning tomorrow, which is ridiculous. That's usually about the time I go to bed. Uh, I met some really neat famous people today, some of which I'd met before, but uh, shooting for a group, a media group, uh, which uh, sells and delivers pictures to a, a large uh, comic news organization. Um, I'm, you know, I had comic books when I was younger, but I'm not into comics or Comic Con stuff. Um, I think it's interesting. I mean, I um, there's a lot of famous people there that I got to uh, hang out with later this evening, and I'm just exhausted. I gotta take a shower. I feel like I'm like sweating my brains out. It was so hot in there. There's so many people. Anyway, I only had to do four hours of work, and the last two were mine. And uh, I met uh, Brent Spiner. By the way, I've got links below to uh, the pictures. I, I I haven't had time. I've uploaded like six or seven pictures. Um, but the pictures that I'm paid for, those are not available because I was paid to do them. And uh, those don't belong to me, so I don't have the rights to those. But that's fine. But I mean, I'm being paid to be down there. Um, took the Fuji X-T1 and uh, the Nikon D750 with the 24-70. The uh, go-to lens. As uh, before it opened, I was uh, yakking with uh, um, some other press photographers that were there, and you know they're sitting there scratching their nuts. I mean, they weren't doing anything. I uh, before uh, the convention opened, I had to cover the opening, and then I had to uh, cover the group and uh, get a bunch of uh, specific shots. And I was told not to take pictures of any of the stars that were there unless I had their permission. One was a nice guy, said, uh, he came up to me, he said, uh, you're the only photographer that looks like he knows what he's doing here, and uh, he was pretty much right about that. And I did a photo shoot with, uh, it turns out to be his sister, who's uh, the actress uh, for the show uh, Jim. I, I know of it, and I can't remember her name, which is awful, but uh, that's because I'm basically worn out. She's a very nice woman, I, I've got a picture of her, she said I could use one of her, my, one of her shots that uh, in the photo shoot that I did on my Flickr page, so I have one of those uploaded. I've uploaded like six shots, and I'm just worn the hell out. I've got like 60 gigs of data to go through, and i got to be there tomorrow and the day after tomorrow, and I don't want to be there. I, it's kind of fun. I was actually uh, yakking with Tiffany for like 20 minutes, and that was kind of cool. Um, I always thought her songs, I mean, she actually has some tattoos, and we were yakking, and, uh, you know, the Tiffany, uh, the singer, so what's that song she did? been a long time now what is it I think we're alone now doesn't seem to be anyone around <laughs> eh. I met uh, Brent Spiner the guy that uh, plays Commander Data I uploaded a picture of him and uh, shook his hand and uh, I'm sure he loves shaking hands he probably hates it um, and uh, he was talking with Denise Crosby and uh, talking to a ta Tawny Katane isn't that her name and, uh, I forgot what else, oh yeah, someone was actually yanking on a curtain and they pulled one of the rods over and I yelled, look out, and uh, the uh, curtain wall with the rods and everything almost landed on Denise Crosby's head. Um, but I was cranking it, man, everybody there, the photographers, so we were yakking and they were just sitting there scratching their nuts, sipping on coffee, and they weren't doing anything. I got up in front of the crowd, um, uh, that was waiting to open since tonight was VIP night and I was uh, back behind the scenes taking shots of the group that uh, I was paid to take shots for and look at it I don't have to post pictures all I have to do I only have to do one thing you know I have to be well I have to do two things on this YouTube thing is that I have to be accurate for you all as far as giving intelligent useful information and I know I'm doing that job and the other thing I have to do is if uh, if I'm uh, you know being paid to do a job for a client, then I gotta make them happy, and uh, I do that. And uh, I, I did a, I did a really damn good job tonight, and uh, I hoofed it uh, like a mother. And uh, I gotta do it in tomorrow. I don't want to go back. Um, I'm not. You know, it was fun. It was neat talking with Tiffany and uh, the actress that, that does the voice, and she's an actress and does voiceover work for Jim. You know, uh, the photo shoot with them was wonderful. She was a really sweet gal. 
Um, I'll uh, see her again tomorrow. I gotta go through all those raw files and edit those for Monday. Um, but I was cranking on it. I had uh, the crowd whooped up there, just me, myself alone, to get some awesome press shots. Because there's three lines and people were waiting there like 20 minutes for the lines to open. And uh, I was up there with the D750 and the speed light and, uh, you know, I whooped them up uh, to get an awesome shot. And, uh, you know, yay! And, uh, you know, that's the shot of, uh, you know, the VIP convention. Uh, that opening shot, that was really neat. You had, uh, there's a lot of, uh, there's a few chicks in like uh, Princess Leia metal bikinis and whatever. I mean, uh, you know, it's kind of neat. There's some neat people in there. Um, one woman was, well, she's not a woman. She's kind of like a young girl, maybe in her 20 or something like that. I, I uploaded a picture of her, I think. There's tons of pictures. I just uploaded like six pictures. She's missing one leg. But she incorporated that leg into a costume, kind of like she's some sort of a future pirate. So she like took her disability where she's missing a leg. She has like a mechanical leg on her right leg, and I was yakking with her, and I took some shots, and uh, you know, I got permission for everything, of course. Um, I didn't get shots of a Tiffany or the other. I didn't want to bother them because they they actually make money by selling those, and this was on my own time. I mean, I had to do my job to you know fulfill the client. Um, request and what I have to do tomorrow and Sunday. Um, but, you know, I had some of my own time afterwards and I was wandering around and uh, it was neat. Uh, you know, there's a few Wonder Women and Wonder Woman, Wonder Women, right? Whatever. Yeah, I'm not into the comic thing at all, um, but it was still a hoot, you know. And uh, me and some photographers were, uh, you know, flapping lips about stuff and uh, he's like he said something like, you know, what sort of gear you got. Um, but honestly, you know, I was the only one that was hoofing it in that whole place. There, I saw like seven photographers. You know, they had some serious gear. You know, there's a few noobs walking around with some point and shoots. You know, whatever gets the job done. Um, but uh, you know, I cranked it out, and uh, uh, I have to say, I did a better job uh, than the rest. Of, I mean, even on my own time, after I fulfilled the needs uh, of what I was, uh, what I was there for. I mean, I didn't pay to get in. I mean. I have, uh, you know, a, a press pass again. It was, it was fun, and the pictures go to them. But, I mean, even on my own time, you know, just for the heck of it, you know, to take shots, I was, uh, you know, I was doing a better job than the rest of those photographers combined. And, uh, you know, I was cranking it, and I was grinding it, and I was kicking ass. So, you know, the important thing is that, you know, you have the skills to make your client happy, and you always want to expand your skills. And I'm absolutely worn the hell out. I have not eaten all damn day, and it's like 11 o'clock at night. And this is the only video I can make because i got to take a shower, and i got to clean some gear. And, oh, by the way, here's a little tip or a trick. If you're uh, using a lens as always in uh, crowded situations, you do is you uh, run uh, some yellow or white uh, electrical tape around it, and that keeps people keeps them a visual acuity of it so they're not bumping into, you know, kind of the same premise of a traffic cone, if you will. Um, since, the, you know, the 2470 is a $2,000 lens, and it is actually a fragile lens. It is not, you know, it's not a tank. It, this is actually a fragile lens. Um, that's a little tip I happen to mention that I've, I never mentioned before. Um, yeah, but, I, man, I, I blew the hell out of the speed light, too, by the way. I mean, I didn't blow it. I brought a couple SB910s, and uh, I went through uh, eight different batteries, and I was blasting the piss knot out of the 910 with the SC29 cable. And uh, I did a really good job today. Anyway, I just got uh, a few shots that are not client shots below that you could see. I got one picture of a Brent Spiner. Um, I didn't get any pictures of Tiffany because I didn't want to bother her, but she was a really cool girl, and I always remember her song, I think we're alone now. Well, that's been ages ago, right? Um, and it was fun, but I mean, it's not my thing, but, uh, you know, I wasn't there to have a good time like the, you know, the crowds of people were, so, you know, I did my job, and I did it well, and I'm going to do it again tomorrow, and uh, that's all that matters, you know, you don't have to please everybody else, you know with your stuff. All you have to do is please the client. All you have to do is deliver. I mean, word of mouth is good enough. You do a good job, people will seek you out. You don't actually, people that are actually trying to shove their work down everybody's throat, those are the people I don't actually trust to do the job right, you know, uh, or really have the skills. It's like, well, what are you making up for? If you got the skills, people will hunt you down. You don't have to be pushing your crap down other people's throat. 
you know. Obviously, if you do do that, you probably get will, will get more work, but, you know, really? Heard some weird noise in the back room. Thanks for watching, and I am just flat out tired, and uh, I can't even believe i got to get up so early in the morning. I do not want to do it, but you make promises and commitments, and uh, you show up and you do them, so. At least it's fun. I mean, you get to meet some uh, Hollywood folk. I forgot who else I met that was uh, really cool. Oh yeah, this uh, neat, the best actor, I forget who it is, from the Jack Sparrow movies, uh, you know, these uh, pirate movies, I forget, I can't remember anybody's name, you know, some uh, famous actor with a big lamb chop sideburns, I forgot his name. I can't remember names for the life of me. But uh, anyway, catch you later, uh, bye. Sorry I uh, don't really have any videos tonight, but I've just been too busy. Thank you. Bye.